Blackboard's March release 3900.86 is available as of today, March 7th, 2024. A few of the newly released items include gradebook item statistics, a no due date option for tests and assignments, default due date time set to 11.59 p.m., announcement indicators and the ability to mark announcements as read or unread, and a bonus feature for those in the AI Design Assistant Pilot, which is a context picker for test question generation. The ability to view gradebook item statistics has been a popular request and is now available by entering the gradebook and from the grid view, you can click on the gradebook item and select statistics or from the list view, you can click on the three dots to the right of the item and select statistics. You can now view the grade count, the minimum and maximum values, the range, the average, the median, standard deviation, and variance. There is also information on the grading status as well as grade distribution. You can select other items to view by clicking the drop down caret and choosing the next assessment that you would like to view. You now have the option to create a test or an assignment without a due date. To do so, click on the plus and create, and then select test or assignment. In the right toolbar, click under due date, and then check the box for no due date. Click save, and you can see that the assignment no longer has a due date. Additionally, the default due date time will now be set to 11.59 p.m. When you create a test or an assignment, you can see that the default time is now set at 11.59 p.m. Another new feature this month is an announcement indicator as well as the ability to mark announcements as read or unread. From student preview, we can see that students will now have an indicator showing that they have new announcements. And once they open the announcements, they can check them as read or unread, depending on their preference. The final feature this month is a bonus feature for those that are piloting the AI Design Assistant. If you would like to join the pilot, you can find a link in the video description. This new feature will allow you to select items in your course to be used to generate test or assignment questions. To do so, once inside of an assignment, click the plus sign and then auto generate question. You can see here, select course items and then you can find the items that you would like to use. I'm going to choose these two items and click select items in the bottom right corner. You can now set the question type. I'm going to choose essay. You can set the complexity and the number of questions. When finished, click generate. Once the questions load, if you like a question, you can select it and add it to the assessment, or you can click generate to generate new questions. Again, if you're satisfied with questions, you can select them and then add them to your assessment. The questions, as well as example responses, will now be added to your assignment. It's important to check the questions and these responses for accuracy. 
You can find more information about these features and others at niu.edu slash or niu.edu slash blackboard.